Hey everyone, this is just a test or demo to show you how B and C uh, on the iPad works and uh, what you uh, can expect from uh, remoting the iPad on your computer. So this is what you get, a tiny uh, little window uh, which uh, shows the iPad screen but the little uh, dilemma here is that the uh, iPad screen is not fluid, it just, it's kind of laggy, about to uh, 1 FPS uh, or uh, 1 frame per sec uh, 2 seconds or something. It's really not very usable. But on the uh, actual iPad, you can see the mouse here very clearly, and it's not lagging at all. The mail! The mail is here! Woo! Yeah, obviously I got me. So anyways, um... Let's try a game. Let's see, um, let's try um, a new um, Angry Birds Space. And it's not, uh, it's not very good to play on the uh, uh, on the iPad through the uh, the PC screen because the because uh, the screen turns black and pretty yeah laggy and yeah it's not, it doesn't work but uh, anyways let's see how it works the Pig Bang try the one j or two just a test. And it works. No problems at all. Except for the sound. Hmm. Actually, no sound. So that is that. So when you right click, end up in a desktop. P press the middle one, you turn it off. And double click the uh, right button, you, uh, you get the menu. But you cannot see the uh, the mouse beh behind it, just uh, ends up behind it. So you uh, just have to guess where you push the button. And uh, no, I have not figured out how to uh, get the iPad screen to not lag and twitch like that. That is a major problem that I really want to fix, but uh, I'm trying to search around for it. So, uh, if you have any questions, just put it in a comment bar or something. And I'll try to help you out as much as I can. Yeah. Thanks for watching, uh, by the way.